Hello and welcome Velocity Banking students, Kingdom citizens, and loyal subscribers. My name is Denzel Rodriguez, your personal finance geek of the 21st century. If you're new, welcome, God bless you, I'm happy you're here. This video is primarily going to be about reflection, perspective, and honoring and giving thanks to a specific YouTube channel that has helped me grow helped me become successful and has given me a lot of perspective around finances. So let's dive right into it. I want to give this video a shout out to Mr. Matthew Pilmore for creating the VIP Financial Education YouTube channel. And this video is going to be a positive video. This is a review. This is also my own personal experience that I've had with that channel. And hopefully, all the viewers, all the people that are discovering these creative financial strategies will help you see the, you know, the comparisons, the perspectives of other YouTubers that are in this tight space of velocity banking, infinite banking, cash flow banking, tax maximization, and you know, credit utilization, credit leverage, and all these way out there strategies that seem radical, but actually simple to us individuals. It's actually pretty simple to us. We look at the other strategies that are pretty radical, the ones that, are, you know, you have to live on rice and beans your whole life, and you, know, you can't use debt, and debt is bad, and all this stuff. Beings that we are in the 21st century, I believe it is super important to evolve, to adapt, to improve your ways of being around money and how you view money and how you operate and conduct yourself in this social media technical advanced world that we are all learning and growing in. So let's dive right into it. So a couple of facts that I pulled off right off their channel, and these are recent numbers, is VIP Financial has over 200,000 subscribers. I'm one of them. They have over 9.5 million views. I would say at least a thousand plus of that comes from me uh, and they have over 400 plus helpful free educational videos that talk about velocity banking infinite banking cash flow maximization uh, credit leverage real estate investing and so many other topics and a powerful statement that they have on their channel uh, about themselves uh, is VIP financial education is the trusted pilot for people who want to dominate the banks. I love it. Companies from NASA to Remax have relied on this curriculum to empower borrowers, borrowers with strategies that quickly grow credit, unlock massive capital, and rapidly wipe out mortgage and non-mortgage debts. Oh yes. The result is a much more powerful borrower, business owner, real estate investor, someone with exponentially more. When he says more, he's talking more safety, more cash flow, more capital, more freedom. It's just math, buddy. Math is math. And so with that being said, I want to tell you a little bit about how I came across VIP Financial and the experiences that I've had with them so far. So I first started making videos in summer of 2018, and I believe VIP Financial have already been making videos for a couple years already, or more than that. VIP Financial was one of the first YouTube channels that I saw someone else talking about velocity banking online. And it was super intriguing and very helpful because I had already knew about velocity banking but I didn't know what it was called. I didn't really know the terms. I was just using credit cards. I was using a line of credit to pay off debt. Nobody really taught me how to do it specifically, but with the help of VIP Financial and their videos and other YouTubers like the Quack Brothers, Valley Investment Club, and a company called Renatus, which is a real estate investment uh, company, real estate educational, company on how to invest in real estate. That was the first company I actually went in person and heard the words of velocity banking. And then when I looked it up online, I was like, oh, this is what it is. And so 
around summer of 2018, I had lost my number one source of income, my J-O-B, my job. And with the help of friends and family, I was always told that I had a good voice and that I should make videos. And so here we are today using my good voice and making videos. God bless. And so with that being said, I literally catered my entire YouTube channel pretty much following what the other successful YouTubers were doing in this creative financial place of different untraditional financial strategies that these guys were talking about. And so I would take countless hours, I mean hours upon hours, really just watching how these guys were operating. And one of the main people was Matthew Pilmore of VIP Financial Education. I literally catered my financial coaching, my consulting services and programs and the way they were doing things. I just copied it. I was like, wow, this is amazing. You know, and I want to do what he's doing. I want to make videos and I want to talk about money and I want to share the velocity banking concept. I believe that everyone should know about this just like everybody knows about Debt Snowball. It's a household name. I want to make velocity banking a household name in America. And so I figured, well, if I'm going to do that, I need to follow whoever's been doing it successfully, effectively and has proven results. And being that most of these successful YouTubers that have big channels have high rates, high coaching rates, because they're experts. So I was like, well, I just lost my job. And if I charged 2% of what these guys are charging, 10% of what these guys are charging, I'll make a couple thousand a month. And I would be happy, right? Because literally, remember, I had lost my main source of income, which was my J-O-B. And I was only making about 2,000 a month, which is actually a salary of 35K a year. So I was only taking home about two grand a month. So all I wanted to do was replace that stream of income. But little did I know the extreme amount of demand there is for these creative financial strategies. So by me watching Matthew and others specifically VIP financial education, I was like, well, there's so many people out there that need help. And there's so many different levels to this game, right? This financial game. Let me just jump in. Let me do what they're doing and see where it goes. And so I want to give credit where credit is due. I want to say thank you to Matthew Pilmore because I can honestly say that in the first year of me making videos, I wanna say it was like literally every other client, at least 30 to 40% of my clientele came from VIP financial education. If it wasn't from them, it was from a similar YouTube channel that was talking about those topics. And so every single time I got a new client, they were like, Oh, I was watching VIP financial videos and you know, I was, I was about to sign up, but I couldn't afford their pricing. So, and then I saw your video and I saw that you were charging a lot less. So I just went with you and I, and so when I discovered that I was like, wow, okay, there's, there's people out there that need the help, but can't afford it. Right? Because these strategies are no joke. They're, they're super advanced and complex, which is why they are expensive. And so I just figured, well, <laughs> I'm not an expert yet. Uh, I've specialized it and I know it and I feel like I can do it. Let me just ride this boat. Let me ride this wagon. So I, I have to credit Matthew because literally, um, you know, we can't help everyone and he's got so many hundreds of thousands of subscribers and I'm sure, you know, he's helping a big portion of them. But then there's also that crowd of people that, you know, they can't afford this stuff. They can't afford anyone for that matter. And so when I first started making videos, I didn't have an, I didn't have two nickels to rub together. So I was literally helping people for free. And that's what was like attracting attention. And I was pretty much just feeding off the information that Matthew was putting out. So if he put out a credit video, I put out a credit video. If he was putting out a, a, a debt snowball video or something about velocity banking, something about infinite banking, 
something about credit or leveraging and paying off debt. I just cater my videos to that. Now, one experience that got me a little bit scared was I um, used the word debt weapons. I wrote it. I believe when you say it, it's okay. But I wrote it on one of my videos, actually a few of them in the past. And I got a nice little message from Matthew saying, hey, how you doing? Love what you're doing, love your videos. But um, please don't you know, refrain from the use of, of debt weapons. And so once I seen that, I was like, oh my God, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go out of business here. I'm making a mistake, oh my goodness. I'm caught, that's it, I'm going to jail. I didn't know, right? And so I started just taking some of those videos down or just kind of like making the word blank so people wouldn't see it. And he was super cool about it. I believe he sent me a message back. He was like, thank you, you know? And I'm like, whew, dodged a bullet there. But now that I am starting to grow this YouTube channel and get bigger and help more people and be an impact and actually be a player, in this space of velocity banking and infinite banking and financial management and you know creative debt payoff strategies i'm actually now a player in this environment and so i want to just give credit where credit is due so this is just a quick video just me saying thank you matthew i appreciate what you do keep doing it keep helping tons of people lead the way right you're the leader and us other youtubers that are building up our channels that want to get to your level and even higher and hopefully one day even collaborate. Who knows? God bless you and God bless everybody watching. Have a wonderful day and God bless.